Many people take their utensils for granted, unaware of the interesting stories and cultural shifts that shape their designs and uses. We assume that they've always been around in their current form, but that's far from the truth. In reality, each utensil has undergone significant transformations over time, influenced by everything from technological advancements to social norms. The truth is, the utensils we use today are a culmination of centuries of innovation, experimentation, and even superstition. Despite their mundane appearance, they hold secrets and stories that are just waiting to be uncovered. From ancient civilizations to modern-day innovations, the history of utensils is a complex and captivating tale that's full of surprises. All it takes is a quick glance at the utensils in your kitchen drawer to realize that they're not as ordinary as they seem. Each one has a unique shape, size, and function that's been carefully crafted over time. But have you ever stopped to think about why they look the way they do? Or how they came to be such an integral part of our daily lives? The answer lies in the fascinating origins and evolutions of these everyday objects. Whether it's the humble spoon, the versatile knife, or the oft-maligned fork, each utensil has a story to tell, and it's time to dig in and explore them. Join me as we explore the shocking truths behind these common items. By the end of this video, you'll see them in a whole new light. But before we jump in, make sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so you don't miss any of our future episodes. So let's now kick off our exploration. 10. The Spoon Let's start with the spoon. This humble utensil dates back to prehistoric times, when people used shells or pieces of wood to scoop food. But the ancient Egyptians took it to the next level. They crafted spoons from wood, stone, and even precious metals like gold. These spoons weren't just for eating, they were used in religious rituals, believed to have mystical powers. As time passed, the spoon evolved into the practical utensil we know today, but its origins are deeply rooted in ancient beliefs and practices. 9. The Fork Next up, the fork. Believe it or not, the fork was once considered a scandalous and unnecessary luxury. In medieval Europe, people primarily used their fingers and knives to eat. The fork, with its tines, was introduced in the Byzantine Empire and later made its way to Italy in the 11th century. However, it wasn't immediately embraced. The church even condemned it, considering it too decadent and unnecessary. It wasn't until the 16th century that the fork became popular in France, and it eventually spread throughout Europe. Today, it's hard to imagine a meal without one, but it's fascinating to think that it was once seen as a symbol of excess. 8. The Knife The knife is one of the oldest tools known to humanity, and its history is as sharp as its blade. In ancient times, knives were primarily made from flint, obsidian, or bronze, and they served both as tools and weapons. But did you know that the table knife, with its rounded tip, was invented to curb violence at the dinner table? In the 17th century, Cardinal Richelieu of France ordered the tips of all table knives to be rounded because he was tired of seeing people pick their teeth with the sharp ends. This simple modification helped transform the knife from a weapon to a safe utensil, shaping the way we dine today. 7. The Chopsticks Chopsticks have been used in China for over 4,000 years, but their origins are more practical than you might think. They were initially used for cooking, not eating. Early chopsticks were long and durable, perfect for reaching into pots of boiling water. It wasn't until later that people started using them as eating utensils. Confucius, a Chinese philosopher, was a strong advocate for chopsticks, believing that knives, being associated with violence, were unsuitable for the dinner table. Today, chopsticks are a symbol of Asian cuisine, but their history is rooted in practicality and philosophical beliefs. 6. The Spork The spork, a hybrid of a spoon and a fork, might seem like a modern invention, but it has roots that go back centuries. Early versions of the spork were used in various cultures, including in ancient Rome, where they had utensils that combined a spoon and a fork in one tool. The modern spork, however, was patented in the 19th century and became popular in the 20th century, especially in the United States. It's now a staple in fast food restaurants and cafeterias, symbolizing convenience and efficiency. 5. The Rolling Pin The rolling pin might seem like a simple tool, but its history is rich and varied. The earliest rolling pins were used by ancient civilizations, including the Etruscans and Romans, who used them to roll out dough for bread and pastries. These early rolling pins were made from smooth, cylindrical pieces of wood or stone. Over time, the design evolved, and the rolling pin became an essential tool in kitchens around the world. Today's rolling pins come in various shapes and sizes, but they all trace their origins back to these ancient tools. 4. The Mortar and Pestle the mortar and pestle is one of the oldest cooking tools still in use today, dating back to ancient times. This simple yet effective tool was used by the Egyptians, Greeks, and Romans to grind spices, herbs, and grains. 
The design of the mortar and pestle has remained relatively unchanged for thousands of years, a testament to its effectiveness. Interestingly, the mortar and pestle were also used in early medicine to prepare remedies and potions, highlighting its versatility as both a culinary and medicinal tool. 3. The Corkscrew The corkscrew's history is closely tied to the history of wine. Before corkscrews, people used knives and other sharp objects to pry open wine bottles sealed with cork. The modern corkscrew was invented in the 17th century, as wine bottles with cork stoppers became more common. The design was inspired by tools used by gunsmiths to clean the barrels of firearms. Today, the corkscrew is a must-have tool for wine lovers, but its origins are steeped in the history of weaponry and wine. 2. The Can Opener The can opener, as we know it today, was invented by William Lyman in 1870. But what's surprising is that canned food was available for nearly 50 years before the invention of the can opener. Before Lyman's invention, people used hammers and chisels to open cans, a method that was both dangerous and inefficient. Lyman's design featured a rotating wheel that cut into the can, making it much easier and safer to open. Despite initial skepticism, the can opener became an indispensable kitchen tool, revolutionizing the way we store and prepare food. 1. The Paperclip While not a utensil in the traditional sense, the paperclip has a fascinating and somewhat sinister history. The modern paperclip was patented in 1899 by a Norwegian inventor named Johan Waller. However, during World War II, the paperclip took on a new role. In Nazi-occupied Norway, people wore paperclips on their clothing as a symbol of resistance against the occupation. The simple act of wearing a paperclip became a silent protest, representing unity and solidarity. Who would have thought that this mundane office supply could hold such powerful symbolism? We've come to the end of our journey through the bizarre origins of everyday utensils. From spoons with mystical powers to forks that were once considered scandalous, it's clear that these common objects hold extraordinary stories. Which one surprised you the most? If you've got a favorite utensil story or a surprising fact you'd like to share, please leave it in the comments below. And if you're new here, consider subscribing for more videos that will blow your mind and make you see the world in a whole new light. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you in the next video.